seizing the opportunity. But right now, here, in thinking about this opportunity, all that comes to mind are the words a wise man recently said to me. We're gonna kick some ass today! Playmakers is an American drama television series created by John Eisendrath that aired on ESPN from August 26th to November 11th, 2003. Now, it depicts the lives of the Cougars, a fictional professional football team in an unidentified city. Now, the show, which ran 11 episodes, was the first original drama series created by ESPN. Now, although the ratings were very high for ESPN, Playmakers was the highest rated show on the network other than its Sunday night NFL and Saturday college football games. And ESPN canceled the series, receiving pressure from the National Football League, who disliked the portrayal of the negative aspects of its players' lives off the field. Now, Playmakers depicted it players taking part in controversial actions and subjects. The show had players doing illegal drugs, steroid abuse, domestic violence, homosexuality, and dealing with money and contract issues. The NFL and team owners weren't cool with how the show put professional football players in a negative light and how the show could ruin football's reputation and damage the relationships with corporate sponsors while also limiting revenue streams. The cancellation triggered the classic debate of the balance between creative freedom and corporate influence. Now, if Playmakers was just telling lies and complete fiction, the NFL wouldn't have wanted the show off the air. Omar Gooding, who played Demetrius Harris, the team's running back on the show, recently confirmed these reports in an interview. Well, you mentioned Playmakers. Mm. And I guess, you know, the series was going, mm. but then ESPN ended up canceling it because the NFL disliked the way that NFL players are being portrayed in the show. Yeah. And it got canceled because of that. Is that accurate? Absolutely. What happened was from the beginning. Now, it's on ESPN. So ESPN said, okay, you got this show about football, inside look at football. And um, the NFL already doesn't like it. But we've committed to the show. Let's put it on. However, we want you to never mention NFL in your interviews. Now, we filmed it in Toronto, Canada. We were out there, so we used the CFL, all of their football players and whatnot. So when they met, when we did interviews, we we're like, yeah, no, CFL, CFL, not not that other one. Like they're like, don't even say NFL in interviews. The producers and the writers specifically made sure not to mention the NFL and anything associated with it, and it still rubbed them the wrong way. On February fourth, two thousand and four, the day after the Super Bowl. Playmakers was canceled. Mark Shapiro, the executive vice president of programming and production at ESPN at the time, told the LA Times that the NFL's reaction was the primary factor in deciding to cancel it. Now, the show got completely wiped off the air, and it is not streaming anywhere currently as this video was being made. Now, the series DVD set is available for purchase. Now, if you do manage to get your hands on the series and go back and watch it, you'll see that it's aged pretty well, and the scenes are still very entertaining. Man, unfortunately, politics behind the scenes robbed the public from a dope show that definitely could have lasted at least five seasons. Playmakers can be credited for helping paving the way for hit shows like The Game, All American, and 
Friday Night Lights that depict what goes on off the field. And what's interesting about the show is that it was an initially well received by actual NFL players and critics. The show's creators try to sell the series to other places. However, due to the NFL's pressure, no network wanted to pick it up. Playmakers actually won some awards too. It won the AFI TV Award for Top TV Series in 2003 and won the GLAAD Media Award for Outstanding Drama Series in 2004. This show had so much impact with just one season. <laughs> Man, just imagine if it hadn't gotten cut so short. Now, if you like content like this, go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, and share. I'm out. I appreciate y'all. Peace.